Welcome back everybody to Uncle Karius. For one, it's not a late night episode. It's like one. It's pretty late though, because I literally just woke up. But it's all good. Let's get this going. I got I got a long day ahead of me. Uh for if you guys some of you guys know I play Fortnite a lot. It's the last season and I'm four levels away from getting the uh finishing off the Omega skin. And I'm not gonna lie, I've been slacking. Well, I'm not going to say I've been slacking. I have work, so I can't be playing the game all the time. So I haven't had time to grind it, but I'm going to try and knock it out all in one day on top of trying to get this episode out to you guys. So we'll see what happens. We will see what happens. Hopefully I can do it. If not, it's not that big of a deal. But we're going to be fighting the Star Caller. Not Star Caller. What is it called? The, the Star Scouter. And hopefully we're going to get a revenge on the buried champion. I don't know why I went this way. Which way is the meteor? Oh, it's over there. Okay, so let's head back home. Some people are annoyed by uh, the levels of my water here. As you can see, if you guys haven't noticed it before, this, this level of water is higher than the other one. Don't worry, guys. I'll fix it. There you go. Alright, so... You guys can enjoy that. What is that? Is that? No, never mind. I thought I saw a worm. You know, I do need some slime, though. Because I did use a lot of slime for Star Mix in the last episode. But yeah, let's head to the right. Because we need a little bit more meteorite. Ooh, that kind of rhyme a little bit. Uh, nothing to look at there. Split Mod always got cool looking sprites, but I don't know nothing to look at there. Let's go ahead. Let's, let's get some of this, though. I feel like... What did I use it on? Obviously, I mined it at some point in time. There's a giant chunk missing. I'm going to avoid mining the one that's already in the sand. Because I hate making the sand fall all the way down. Because it looks weird. And it's just annoying. When if I start suffocating? That's deadly. Oh my god. Back up, demons. Oh damn, I didn't see that one. The ebonstone and the sand look very similar in color. Which is expected because they're like the same biome. Infection from the same biome. You know, a biome needs more like. Not art, artistic styling. It needs more uniqueness to it. The snow biome. I like that split. The split mod adds a little snow viking ship down there, whatever you want to call it. That's really cool, but obviously it's not vanilla. I feel like vanilla needs to do something about the snow biome. Because I want it to be like a direct opposite to the jungle. And it pretty much is right now, but it's definitely not as cool as the jungle. So I feel like there can be some additions there. Maybe we'll, someone will make a mod called uh, Snow Biome Additions. i download it. I, I like little addition mods that feel like vanilla. That's why I need to really experiment with more mods. Because when I watch, at least when I watch Fury... I always see he has some little mods in there, or some mods I've never seen. Oh, dang, that's cool. How come I've never seen that? It's because I don't try out other little mods. And I don't know if he exactly does, but from what I've seen, there's a lot of mods that he uses that I've never used before. Oh, we have a chance to do something here. Y'all heard that? So when you kill this guy, there's something he drops that you can catch. Where is it? I don't know what it was. Wait, no, that's not it. What is this? Interesting. Uh, I don't know. Maybe someone was lying to me. I didn't even see anything spawn that time. But someone told me when you kill that enemy, there's a chance for something to spawn in. But let's go ahead and let's make us some meteorite bars, which we then turn into the scouter. I have confidence that this boss will not be a problem. Is that what it's called? Star Scouter? Star. Star Caller. There you go. I got it. Boom bada bing. I think the boss is called the Star Scar Scouter. So let's find a nice place to fight this boss. We can do it over here. That'd probably be a good place at spawn. Did I do the fishing quest? I don't know if I did the fishing quest. Let me check. Where is it? Nah. No. Alright. Let's check. Fuck. I didn't. I can do this real quick. I'm trying to stack up them fishing quests, alright? It's gonna be useful when we have them all stacked up. Because, uh, 
when we need that fishing, the lunar fishing shotgun later on. Well, actually, we already have the golden fishing rod. I just want to do all the quests, alright? Done caught it. I'm too damn strong at fishing. Junior pole, bro. Do I look like I need a damn junior pole? I also don't need this, but we'll switch them out. I don't remember when I got that fishing hook. I think it was from the uh, odd crates. This is where I got the fishing hook. Like, the grappling hook. I like it. It's one of my favorite grappling hooks. I know there's wings we could get once we enter hard mode. And I'm hoping we get them pretty easily. I don't know how much room we need for this boss. I know this boss, you move around a lot while fighting. So we're going to expand this a little bit. Hopefully it won't be too much of a problem. I mean, if we really need to, we can just drop down to the floor. Like, that wouldn't be that big of a problem. But ready? Let's do it, boys and girls. I need more of those uh, buffs I've been using. How come my potion isn't filled? Was it always like that? Maybe it was always like that. Let's do it. I should probably re-equip that. Because I switched it for fishing because your fucking line breaks a lot while fishing. Bro, throw out the hook. There you go. My dude was just keeping the hook inside him. Bro, I can't stop talking about it. I really like the new boss bar things. It's such a little difference, but it's so cool. <laughs> hey, shout out to these NPCs doing work. Rupert. His name is Rupert. Never mind. I took that back. What's her name? Alice. That's fine. Jan Mayer. Okay. Alice is the only one I respect. Imagine being named Jan Mayer. Rupert. Rupert? Bitch. What? Whose name is Rupert? I'm sorry for all the Ruperts out there. That's a bad name. It ain't even unique. It just sounds stupid. <laughs> Y'all seen that dodge right there? And I walk into that. I don't like that ball. That ball is his strongest ability. It does like zero damage, but it always hits me. I'm trying to figure out which one's the one that does a lot. So that big one. That big beam one seems like it does the most damage. I don't want to even try and get hit by the little ones. Okay, the little ones do a lot of damage too. I, that was kind of like a forced, forced hit right there. Bro, this is just like a summoner playthrough. This is like, <laughs> this is like a weaker version of the summoner playthrough. Oh shit! Now nah, we gonna stay attached to this boy. We gonna take him out. Take his ass out while he's sitting there. Boy trying to hibernate in the middle of a fight. What the hell you think this is? Sandy cheeks looking ass, bro. I'm getting slowed. Oh my god. Ah! <laughs> I keep getting slowed. Just kill the man. It's not a man. It's a ship. Just kill the ship. Why am I floating? Oh, we can move again. Bro, this is some cheese right here. Imagine being a spaceship and getting killed by a fishing hook. That's, embar that's more embarrassing than having the name Rupert. Imagine, <laughs> imagine having, having, having the name Rupert. <laughs> can y'all get out of here? And spaceships. Are they still trying to fight me? I think they're flying away. But they're still trying to attack me as they fly away. What a bunch of assholes. Get away from me. So we got the uh, Omega Drive. We're not going to use that. We've seen the Omega Drive a million times. I'll hold on to it, though. That's what I usually do. I usually just hold on to the expert drops. Because I'm a good person. That's why. That's exactly why. This, uh... Hold on. I'll show you guys. Do these crates give you anything in hard mode? I think they do. So we'll hold on to those, too. Uh, who am I selling you? You get to have this. Let's make sure our next quest is correct here. Yep, it's the wild flesh. I'm pretty hyped once we fight the wild flesh. That accessory we get from it, I'm pretty hyped to get. But I'm uh, moving on. We gotta take on the uh, strange guy. What the hell's the name? <laughs> Not strange guy. What the hell's the name of that boss? Bird champion. That's who we gotta take out. See, I want to use the fishing knife, but look at the next upgrade for the fishing knife. Cobalt? Are you kidding me? Okay. Oh, we get another chance. We get another chance. Look, it just... Maybe it spawns in and I kill it, but, like, it's hard to not kill it. <laughs> I have to either... I have to use my fishing hook to kill it. Which is even harder because there's, like, a million things that he spawns in. So I gotta finesse my way. Because if I use this, I'm hitting everything. If I use this, I'm hitting everything. It's, like, it has to be perfect. I think he spawns in, like, a little wisp right when he dies. And it's hard to catch it. But, yeah, I wanted to make a new fishing knife, but, like, he literally can't. You cannot make one for the longest time. I don't know why they did it like that. Because I'm not going to have this equipped. It's too weak to have it equipped. Can I make this? Sealed hook. Oh, fuck. I, I thought I was going to be able to make that. 
Because I could easily get the super barbed hook. You know what? Let's get the super barbed hook. I didn't do that. So check this out. While exploring, I think it was in the last episode. Let me hide up here. While exploring, I did find the temple right there. So what we're going to do, we're going to go and try and phase through the temple. But the thing is, can I pick up the hooks? What mining power do you need to pick up the hooks? I have no clue. How how good is a hellstone pickaxe? Well, hold up. Let's look at everything else here. Make sure there's nothing else I can get. I'm pretty sure there's nothing else I can get. Nope, can't get that. I mean, we can get the mana escalation reel. Piece of barber damage at two percent. This is really good. Like that's really fucking good. But what do I replace? The omni lure? No. Probably the barbed hook. You know what? Let's do it. So to make this, we gotta get some specific potions. I was looking at these things too. So there's this link cable. Damage increase my amount of bobbers stuck to different enemies. Eh, that's okay. And then we got this. Redirector wire. Thorns damage is instead dealt equally to all enemies with their bobbers attached. And then we got thorny redirector. I don't... Isn't it the same thing? I'm assuming it does more damage. I don't know how useful that is because we are only using one lure. How many lures do we have if I take this off? We have two. I don't know, man. People said they want me to more use more lures. We might do that later. Like, later in the playthrough. I think this one is the one that sells. No, it's the f either this shop or the next one. It's the next one. So, we need this. Bob Escalation. Bob. We need Bob Potions. What else can I get? That's going to increase damage by 8% per second while the Bob is attached to the same enemy. Oh, that's 11 gold per... Bro, I feel like we'll destroy the bird champion if we use that, so we're going to do that. Uh, but other than that, let's toss that in there, and we should be able to make it. Okay, I'm... Oh, the star mix. Duh, I knew that. I just put a bunch of gel in there, so we better be good, I think. Mana. Esk. Mana escalation reel. So we're going to get rid of the uh, barbed hook for now. And let me look at something. How much how much uh, pickaxe power is the molten pick? It's 100, so it don't even matter. Unless you can mine the uh, spikes in the jungle. The wooden spikes in the jungle. Unless you, that only requires 100% pickaxe power. It don't matter. I'm not going to worry about it. But yeah, let's go find... Ooh, nah, we don't need Uncle Karius, though. Let's go find the buried champion and let's destroy him. All right. That boy needs to chill. Uh, I found it right there and I almost broke it. Oh, fuck. <laughs> okay, accidentally broke it. Let's do it. It's go time. We're putting this bobber to the test. Oh my god, I forgot how much you have to move off find this boss. This is not fair. I wasn't ready again and he just kind of spawns in. He just kind of does that a lot. He just appears from nowhere. Bro, I keep forgetting that he does that. Oh my god, this is so bad. I keep forgetting the little fucking swords he spawns from the sky. Oh, he's getting his ass beat now. He's, he's quivering. That boy quivering. Shit, how did I get hit? I didn't see anything near me. That's right, you better get your Buckingham Palace looking ass. I don't even know what that's. That don't even make sense. It don't matter. He's dead. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. Bitch. Alright, let's head to spawn. That's enough being rude, I'm sorry. Uh, So, I found a Scarlet chest down there which is that chest and I ha already have a ring of unity and they're pretty useless from what I know at least in single player so obviously I'm not gonna be able to use it I have like 10 lava charms what's in the bag arcane champion wing all right let's see here we can fly up to the cook almost higher than the cook does this go higher than the cook oh my god it went way higher than the cook I like how like all these wings seem to you know slowly knock each other out you know what i'm saying like they slowly as you go through hard or pre-hard mode each wing is better than the other which is surprising i don't know how good the skyline wings are i know those were usually the second wings i'd get i'd get the ones from thorium the og ones from thorium and then i would go for the skyline ones after looking at my gold making sure we're good we're fine i don't have no problem spending this gold all right there we go we can sell these wings too while we're at it 
we do have a fishing quest I need to do. But yeah, we pretty much completed everything this episode. Which is always a good thing. Let me just drink it. Might as well. Ah, I'm hot right now. I'm on fire, bitch. Oh, what? Standing on water doesn't negate the fire damage. If y'all know what conflagrate potions do. There you go. A burning fury has taken a hold and it makes your damage higher. Something like that. But yeah. Guess what fish we have to catch. If you guessed it, that's 10 free terraria copies for you. Share it with your friends. It's a bone fish. Let's go find another bone fish. My favorite fish. We need to upgrade our boots. Why are our boots hardy? I think because lightning boots cost like 10 times the amount all the other ones cost. Hold up. Let me do something right here. Are you used for anything, Mr. Goldfish? Besides a potential stew, like fish stew, bowl of soup. That's it. Bro, what? We can, we can get this fish bowl. That counts towards the aquarium stuff. Soup pot. Okay, interesting. That's 60 minutes. You can go from 30 to 60. That's worth it. Maybe I need to get a fish farm. Like an actual fish farm. Speak about fish farm. There is that, uh... What the hell is that thing called? Oh, we already caught it. Yeah, might as well catch some more. There is that auto fish catcher. Whatever it's called. You know how I got the auto chest for wood? There's one for fishing, and that's going to be very, very useful. Because I remember when I was during the David playthrough, I would use that to uh, switch fish for quests. So I never actually had to fish, like do the fishing quest. I could just craft the fish. It's really useful for that. And also, it auto gathers fish. I like, guess very useful. But uh, we'll see. We will see. We don't need another rock fish. Something with another bone fish. All right, that's enough. No more fishing. Stop it. Stop it. So, what do you guys think? Should I get rid of the Omni Lure and try out the. Um, what the hell was it called? I know one's called Redirector. Should I try this out? Thorny Redirector? What do you think I should get rid of for this? I'm not getting rid of the shield. I'm not getting rid of the lightning boots. And I don't want to get rid of these two. These two are actually really good. I like it. Well, maybe uh, this one. That's all 50 damage received. See, look, like, I don't even take damage sometimes. Like, well, that enemy's really weak. I don't know. Either we get rid of the shield shaft or we get rid of the omni lure for the redirector. But if you guys really want me to, I could try uh, doing more bobs. That means we'd have to get rid of the omni lure no matter what. So I could try that. Let's do this. You guys get the video to 50 likes. I'll do the. I'll do more than one lure. Cause I kind of like our setup. I like the Omni lure, man. That's a lot of damage it does, and I really like the amount of damage it does. But other than that, we're gonna end off this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed. My name is Uncle Carius. It's not actually. It's Game Raider. So get it right.